The Indian Space Agency's row has successfully launched its latest weather satellite, Insat 3DS, on board the GSLV F-14 rocket from Sri Harikota in the state of Andhra Pradesh. I'm very happy to announce the successful accomplishment of the mission, GSLV F-14, Insat 3DS. The spacecraft has been uh, injected into a very good orbit. Uh, the injection conditions were uh, as expected, and uh, we also noted that the vehicle has performed very, very well. Now, according to ISRO, this is the GSLV 16th mission in which it will deploy the INSAT 3DS meteorological satellite into the geosynchronous transfer orbit. Now, what is the hype around the INSAT 3DS, and what can it mean for India? Now, the satellite will boost India's weather and climate monitoring services. INSAT 3DS is 51.7 meters long as a third-generation upgraded and dedicated meteorological satellite. With a weight of about 2,274 kilograms, it is built at a cost of nearly about $57.8 million. ISRO has said that it will boost the monitoring capabilities for both land and ocean surfaces, and the enhanced warning systems will also aid India in braving weather-related crises and will reduce the loss of lives during calamities. The new satellite also boasts of a search and rescue transponder that can help tap and locate distress calls using special equipment. And this equipment is commonly found in ships and is even carried by mountaineers. As of now, India has three active weather satellite systems that include the INSAT 3D, the INSAT 3DR and also the OceanSat. And Vyond Siddharth MP has been tracking the story very closely for us and has sent us this report from Sri Harikota. Listen in. We're coming to you from Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota as the GSLV F-14 rocket is lifting off from here from the second launch pad. So this is a flight of the GSLV where it will be carrying India's weather monitoring satellite. So this weather monitoring satellite is known as INSAT 3DS. So as we speak, the vehicle is lifting off majestically behind us. So you can see the vehicle lifting off. So this is actually a 2.2 ton satellite that's flying to Earth orbit and equatorial orbit. It will be injected into its initial orbit in just about 19 minutes from now. So after that, what will happen is the satellite will gradually be steered into its eventual orbit, which is about 36,000 kilometers above the Earth's equator. This is meant for weather monitoring. So it will monitor the weather, not just for India, but the entire Indian subcontinent and adjoining region, particularly studying the atmospheric parameters, the ocean and the related conditions to help the meteorological agencies, both in India and abroad, predict weather and weather related disasters. So this is actually part of a series of satellites inside 3DS has two predecessors already in orbit insat 3d and insat 3dr this will be the third one and the most advanced in the series so this is actually a significant mission that india is performing and this is actually a mission executed by isro for what is known as india's ministry of earth sciences under which the meteorological department and several other departments that study weather and weather related phenomenon belong from Sri sriharikota siddharth mp beyond world is one beyond is now available in your country download the app now and get all the news on the move